Hey, two viewers, TJ Pyramid here. Just wanted to kill a couple seconds at the beginning. I don't know why. So uh, this is a uh, video entry into uh, my buddy Falagar, a.k.a. Sammy. His uh, weekly contest that he has going on. He's going to have three of them, so three weeks. Each week's a different contest. The prize is a uh, $10 Amazon card. Badass. So uh, this is the first one, and it's a... Uh, two questions here. Um, I wrote them down. The first question is, uh, what's your favorite superhero or vigilante film um, of all time? So, you know, I kind of scanned around the Blu-rays and the uh, DVDs, and there were a couple that jumped out at me right away. Uh, but I, you know, had to pick one. So, I picked one that really had an impact on me. It's a newer film, but it just really had a uh, impact on me. The, the visceralness of it, the colors, the characters. Um, I cannot wait to see another full-length film from the uh, gentleman who made this. And uh, that movie is uh, Rudger Hauer and Hobo with a Shotgun. I absolutely love this film. Uh, I first saw this, I believe, in a Rue Morgue magazine years ago. And uh, it was the cover that caught my eye at first. It's the dude designs. If you don't know him, Google him. He's a badass artist. Does a lot of good stuff. Does a lot of stuff for Arrow Video. Uh, just really fantastic artist. I always love all the stuff going on in his art. But uh, yeah, this was... um. Directed, edited by uh, Jason Eisner, written by John Davies. Uh, Jason Eisner's eye for shooting stuff is just absolutely spot on. About as spot on as Rudger shooting somebody with a shotgun in the face. But uh, the characters in this, the bad guys are such assholes in this. You've got uh, these nasty gentlemen right here in their armored suits. you got Rudger Hauer who's just like... A hobo with a shotgun. And he just goes around dealing out his brand of justice. Uh, the colors in this movie pop. The colors in this are just like super bright, neon, techno, disco daddy, let's rock and roll mama all night long. Colors that just blind your eyes with a glaring glaze of delicious donuts but I just love this film I just think it's a badass film um, so there we go there's my pick for uh, my favorite vigilante film right there hobo with a shotgun if you have not seen this you're really missing out and uh, the second question is a uh, would you rather have this or this and it is a uh, for the rest of your life would you rather have your toe and fingernails ripped off a minute apart? And you know, not fast, but... And uh, if they, and they, you know, grow back or whatever, he said, you know, magically they grow back and it's done again. Fingernails and toenails for the rest of your life. Or would you rather have your coarsely grained short hairs, your coarsely grained pubic hairs switch places with your other hair. So I'm assuming your pubic hair switches places with your arm hair, your head, this, that, and beyond. So I think I'd rather just have the, uh, the I'd, I'd rather have the hair switch um, because that's not really painful. Uh, I don't really want my fingernails and toenails ripped off because that requires pain. And, uh, I'm just not a big fan of pain. So I think I'd rather just have my, uh, my <whistles> switch places with this and this and whatnot, you know. I can brush it all the same. Just a little bit more coarse, you know. My comb or brush might get caught in it and I'll have to pull it once in a while and probably yank out a couple hairs and they'll 
sprinkle across the bathroom floor or some such. But uh, yeah, I comb this just as just as fine, you know. Style it up. Maybe have a nice uh nice afro of some sort going on or something. I don't know. So yeah, I'd rather just have my switch places with this hair. Whatever. Mm, I don't know. So yeah, there's the uh, answers to uh, this week's questions. Um, good luck to anybody else who enters this contest. Maybe nobody else will enter and I'll automatically win. Hmm. So yeah, there we go. Good question, Sammy. Can't wait to see what next week's uh, questions are. You always have some interesting questions, my friends. That's why when I do my contest for my 200 subscribers, I gotta come up with some pretty damn fine questions, mister. So there we go. Comment down below. Subscribe to my channel and to Faligar's channel. Do it. And, uh, yeah. Take care and, uh, cheerio. Thanks for watching.